Shit. Yo. It's a year. Now, y'all may be asking me, what, what, what is this kid talking about? A year. Like, just all the other years? No. About this time last year, I started working out. I don't know if, if y'all have even noticed the gains. Like, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. I can't put it too low because I'm in my underwear. Because I pay the bills up in this, please. So I can walk around in my underwear if I want to. Shoot, I can walk around here bucky naked. But anyways, hugging. Hugging the sleeves. All right, bring it back up. Anyways, I just wanted to make a quick little intro into this uh, one-year body transformation that I uh, like kind of put together. I took a couple pictures. And it's not all that, but uh, I'm just showing like the results from like. Uh, like an average person like myself and uh, where I started from and then where I have gone in like a year. The thing that really like um, got me into bodybuilding last year and uh, what really just made me want to be consistent with this about this time last year and the picture where I, I took I took the picture like this and I'm in front of the mirror I'm not smiling and uh, I think I had some red underwear on. I had some red underwear. I think I think so. Around that time, I was going through some bad times, man. Some bad times. Like one thing uh, with this girl that I really liked. She told me she needed time and just cut off like all like everything. And then that, that was kind of like hard for me at that time. And as you can see, at, at that uh, that picture, I was around like 180. So I completely just like let myself go. And even before that, I was like that weight for a while. And like, I was just looking sloppy. Like, look at my hair. Look at my hair in that picture. I was looking sloppy. So um, I just said, you know what, fuck this. I want to change my life. I want to become better and uh, put myself in a better situation. And I'm here. I'm here now. You know what I'm talking about? Hugging. Oh, hugging the sleeves. You see? And I just want to show that it's possible. Bodybuilding. It's years. It's not weeks. It's not months. It's not days. It's years. It's years of eating right foods, knowing how much you need to eat in order to do what you're trying to do. Like, I was cutting at some times of the year, and then I was bulking. Right now, I'm bulking. So that's why you're not seeing me post all these weight loss uh, uh, updates, because I'm, I'm not cutting no more. I used to be 161 at the lowest. Now, I'm 170. So, you know, I'm fat swole right now. Um, but yeah, everything's going great with this bodybuilding thing. Um, and I feel so much better. I'm in like a so much better place as opposed to where I was last year. Like mentally, emotionally, uh, physically, I was, I was, I was fucked up, man. You could tell. Like I... I look at myself now as opposed to a year ago, I'm, I was just fucked up. The girl I was dealing with, it, the, the uh, situation, it was just fucked up. And that, that was what uh, kind of propelled me into doing this. And then I kind of dip and dabbled. And then I found out what works, what doesn't work, how I'm able to go to the gym on a more consistent basis, like mentally, like actually stepping into the gym every time you're supposed to be in the gym so yeah man let me stop talking this the body transformation one year from shit to fit
but we not done yet, man. This is a journey. This is a lifestyle, and I'm gonna I'm gonna start posting like things that I'm eating. Um, like wait, hold on. I told y'all I was in my underwear. No, I was playing, boy. Like this is like one of the things I like to eat, and like right now I'm bulking. So this is refried beans, a little bit of sour cream for you people that's on a diet out there. With a little bit of chives on that, you know, keep it fancy, keep it fancy, pinky up. Talking, y'all enjoy this uh this thing.